hmm. and mercury 17 months so i did this divided by and i i i told him this is the uh, years and month you exactly started the problem has been started and he say yes on that so my question now because first 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 row i i pick the days so i was wrong at that then i pick the month and days i was again wrong on that and third time i was right so how do so when we do the event or future event timing or past event timing how should i pick the days and month which that i'm i'm i get confused in that movable sign days movable sign days oh move, okay dual sign month fixed sign years oh okay now movable. i cannot i cannot say him that it is from 76 years so i will just you know like convert it into the way you did because the number is quite high if this was say you say seven seven answer then i will say seven years because the seventh lord is in a fixed sign specifically that is a sign of saturn you know so saturn to is quite a late planet so that is what we will do the movable sign is days fixed is months and fixed sorry movable is days dual is month and fixed is years abhi 76 years must not have been a logical answer so we just the way that you divided it so what uh, 126 just 72 So uh, six years and four months. Something. That was the correct answer. So just yeah, the so same thing that Jupiter being in a fixed sign, the seventh lord being in a fixed sign. The scenario is yes. So I okay. So now he has he he has questioned me. So how my divorce is when my divorce is going to happen? So I. count because of seventh lord jupiter mm -hmm. so i took the principle of that how the jupiter is going to travel because it is in retro so is is going to travel on other side so he is going to meet first first uh, saturn so yeah. that process is going to be really delayed yeah right and then he then he gonna goes on 4000 4000 is no planet and then when he jupiter meets ketu then he will have a divorce yeah. now saturn here i took like because i i have a list so i took 19 but then over here also i get confused 19 months or Four month, four months and forty five days, or one and a half month. So I, I just get wrong on again here. So twenty months. Twenty months. Twenty months. I will go. I will tell you why. Divorce seen from the eight house. What? What is seen? Divorce is seen from the eight house. Yeah. Eighth Lord is situated in the twelfth house, expecting the seventh house. Divorce is going to happen. But the Vara Mehir principle, I don't know which course I taught it. The basic principle of Vara Mehir is that when the Eighth Lord is afflicted in Navamsha, it gives the divorce. So for divorce, I will be pretty simple. Check the Navamsha of the Eighth Lord if he is afflicted. Divorce is there. So I go to the Navamsha. I see Masuk Ketu. Then joining the seventh lord, divorce is there. Now he is in the Navamsha of Venus. Venus is twenty. In D one, Venus is in a dual sign. Twenty months. Hmm. Twenty months, I will say. In twenty months from right now, this thing is going to happen. And I, I, I told him that divorce is gonna be make little uh, legality problems. And yeah, legality problems is there because of Saturn and Mars both expecting the seventh house. Yeah. So yeah, so so my my so in consultation I was like sixty percent right 
bang on and 40% i was completely wrong not so, an important uh, issue nilesh you though i am pretty happy like i will tell you the level of consultation you are doing many people are afraid of right so at least you know like trying to assess you know since how what time it started and still your third attempt was correct that it started in 7 uh, years or what 6 years or something or 7 years or something you are giving a correct answer when the problem started it is very high level of astrology people are afraid that they teach astrology they cannot take consultation because they know we will go terribly wrong and this person will come after four years and will tell that sir your prediction never worked and you are going up to this high extent of prediction i am like very proud of it because this is only my bachchas can do and this is truth no the see i i you know how how i make my notes i am very i am very precise about to taking my notes and all your notes is helping me like in great level okay. if you see if you see my i am going to once by once prashna i will done i'll send all my notes you see i i make like i make each and every i every videos i see like three times four times if if i don't understand i don't move one minute i just keep on stuck over there i think what what you are trying to say when i when i grasp it then i'll move my video from there so i am so that makes me so perfect and my nature of predicting i always wanted to go very near to the event like i i i don't want to miss i i want to do say one days or two days here and there that's fine but i always wanted to go near to the event whether it is past or future you went there in the third attempt nilis it is quite like commendable you haven't even completed one year with me <laughs> complete one year your first attempt will be done this is so all the thanks level, to the level of hard work you are doing you know what hard work always pays that is true the hard work always pays isme koi there is no doubt about it saturn is always a benefit yeah so these are so they have many many questions but i don't want to go detail much because i, I don't want to waste much time on this so this person was having an affair <laughs> <laughs> he, he also called me he also tell the same time his he uh, her girlfriend is 24 years and she's in she's in philippines so she make right conference call right in in front he, he was here with me and he called me from here and he asking about his girlfriend as if he don't he say, he understand i don't know what's going on in in his life because i have his horoscope and i, I have his prashna so i have asked him so he said uh, she wants to be here in in us she wants to be do some uh, study in medical thing and that thing so i understand I, i i didn't explain him that you want him to bring here so you can marry or you can have some kind of relation with her because i have seen the venus in his in his prashna is on lagna so he is lot of always thinking about the luxury about woman about uh, i will uh, i will tell you two big trends personally let's this this is like two thumb rules i have okay moon or venus in like oh, like any of them in the seventh house the person whoever is asking the question have someone else in the mind other than the wife that is sure okay he have someone else in the mind no matter how much simple person he becomes he has another rule is venus moon both either in the same category of sign like both dual dual yeah both movable movable or one dual one movable the person have bro- broke the boundaries of marriage and have had an outside physical relationship before coming to the consultation it doesn't happen in a fixed sign moon and venus otherwise both of them in a dual sign both of them in a fixed sign or one in the fixed sign one in a dual sign the person have broke the boundaries of marriage and then came for the consultation he is already the culprit 
in this particular case no matter how much the person says my wife is that my wife is this that i am always like you are the main culprit wife is not the culprit and his wife is only argumenting see the 10th lord is in the 12th house mars the 8th lord and the 3rd lord is in the 12th house along with mercury the 10th lord and the 7th lord so 10th lord going in the 12th house because your karmas are not appropriate that's why the wife is fighting i will not say that wife is wrong at any given point of time wife is right correct he have done a mistake he is not able to admit it that's why she is so fierce i i told i told her and uh, he was he was there so i told that uh, her girlfriend that do you have one relationship which is broken and you reach you were in uh, in in your school or wherever your social circle you have one relationship physical relationship and you have then broke so she so she was first time she was denied she says no 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 i don't have any lesson i said are you sure just because sometimes see, they they don't want to agree right away when you when i you say something shocking he said no 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 i don't have then he said no yes no oh, i remember i have in school i have one boyfriend and these and days i said okay, okay that that's why i i I don't want to explore more on it, but I just wanted to confirm because right now the Prashna shows this. Yeah. So, so I was really very much, and I was using all your technique. I always see. I have. I always make the list here. First, I see sun, sun. Then I see Hora Lord. Then I see uh, Drikana. Then I see Chhatra. Then I see Mukh Prashna. So. in prashna this is my five i made out of your prashna course i made this this thing uh, so this i i i i all already have a grip on that now so my another one question when you see the chhatra how you see the mukh arudha so i always get confused i you you show us the one technique of minutes so whichever the minutes you have in the prashna that from that i can pick the arudha Uh, 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 that that uh, 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 that was that was just for the jamkol stuff oh jamkol it was just for the jamkol stuff right it was just for the jamkol stuff i will i will just tell you that chhatra was you count from hey yeah, hey just a sec yeah chhatra is you count from arudha to the ascendant arudha to the ascendant But, and the but same where? number from chhatra, sorry, the same number from vithi is the chhatra. See, I already did out count how many house from arud rashi to vithi rashi. That is that is for the mukh prashna one. But in that mukh prashna, how do I found arud? Because I'm 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 oh, yeah. I'm. I'm in the mukh prashna one, what you do is first of all you will count from the chhatra to. मुख प्रश्न yeah this this you can see now yeah count the number from arudha to chhatra rashi arudha to chhatra rashi arudha was what arudha was this right 0 to 5 minutes it is aries 5 to 10 minutes it is it is taurus this was the arudha right so we have to count from arudha to chhatra rashi and the same number counted from uday lagna gives the oh. chhatra that should be used for the mukh prashna oh so i am also using the uh, yeah. same thing i thought in chhatra there is some other method to finding no, no. the mukh aru no 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 no, no. this is the one oh, yeah. okay okay and when we use uh, when we use chhatra to find what have happened previously then we count from aru to janm lagna and the same number counted from viti there are two methods for it one to find the mukh prashna and one to find what happened before Yeah, data that I have two, two, two methods out. 
नीलेश जी बहुत मजा आ रहा है नीलेश जी फॉर दैट प्रश्न डू यू नो वॉट वॉज अरुण अरुण साइन सो आई टूक सो दैट इज 19 minutes right so 19 minutes i took that 1 uh, 2 cancer fourth house yeah hmm.